Okay, first things first, we're going to start off with the visible light spectrum. I'm sure as a lot of you probably already know, humans can only see a very minuscule amount of the visible light spectrum. It is said to be 0 0.0035, which is way less than 1%. This is translated as the rainbow Roy G. Biv in the colors that we as humans can see. So within this whole divine simulation, us as humans are only operating from a tiny, tiny percentage of the overall simulation, which is kind of scary. And this overall spectrum is electromagnetic wavelengths radiation, which is comprised of photons. This also correlates to you as an individual and your collective oversoul. The expression that is you in this now reality is just a tiny minuscule portion of the overall energy that is your oversoul, that is your higher self. So the way that we experience ourselves is we refract or fractal ourselves down into this divine hologram simulation in order to have a new experience. This also correlates back to the fact that 99.9% .9 of matter is actually empty space. So although everything is pretty much empty space, we still perceive it as physical and experience it that way because we are indeed holograms ourselves. We as humans have a light body which are comprised of many different layers of different bodies the mental the casual the physical and so on oh so if you take a look at this photo here you'll notice that each layer of your light body correlates with a different color or electromagnetic frequency on the visible light spectrum are indeed beings of light existing on the electromagnetic spectrum very similar to what a hologram is if you need more evidence of this there are plenty of declassified cia documents which express the holographic nature of our reality now this is the infamous analysis and assessment of the gateway experience by the cia notice on page seven it talks about holograms Energy creates, stores, and retrieves meaning in the universe by projecting or expanding at certain frequencies in 3D mode that creates a living pattern called a hologram. Furthermore, on page 8, it goes into the conscious matrix. The universe is composed of interacting energy fields, some at rest, some in motion. It is, in and of itself, one gigantic hologram of unbelievable human mind is also a hologram which attunes itself to the universal hologram by the medium of energy exchange thereby deducing meaning and achieving the state which we all call consciousness now here's an exercise where you can physically see the hologram in this reality now just as you can see on this filter you can notice that there's like a slight pixelation within this filter Take a look at either a blank white wall or at the sky, that's where it works the best, and just stare at it for a while. I can see this naturally without staring, a lot of people can, but you'll notice in real life with your eyes, it's pixelated. And personally, I have noticed this pixelation increasing more and more throughout the years. Now, the divine simulation or hologram is a completely different concept from the matrix. I can go into that into another video. Comment below as to why this reality is a hologram. I can't possibly list all of the reasons.